Hello guys. Are you planning to take the master plumbing licensure exam? Can we test your knowledge? Here are 35 questions for the plumbing code subject. This will be largely based on the revised National Plumbing Code of the Philippines with other plumbing references. Before we start, you should know that the examination will be a 100-item test with only 2 hours to answer. It will have an aggregate weight of 10%. There will be different subtopics for this. Let us have an overview. The basic principles. Did you know that the plumbing code has 22 basic principles? Yes. That's 22. You should know these. Let us start with question number one. ECC stands for A. Effective cross connection. B. Enclosed circuit connection. C. Environmental compliance certificate. Or D. Elbow corporation cock. The answer? It's C. Environmental Compliance Certificate ECC stands for Environmental Compliance Certificate Again, Environmental Compliance Certificate Question 2 A pressure relief valve is required if water pressure in the system exceeds blank A. 15 PSI B. 80 PSI C. 100 PSI Or is it D. 150 PSI the answer is B80 PSI. A pressure relief valve is required if water pressure in the system exceeds 80 PSI. Remember that PSI stands for pounds per square inch. It is commonly used to measure the pressure of gas. Question 3. The administrative authority requires that every request for inspection be filled at how many days before such inspection is intended? A. 3 calendar days. B. 5 working days. C. 3 working days. Or D. 5 working days. The answer? Is C. 3 working days. 3 working days. The administrative authority requires that every request for inspection be filled 3 working days before such inspection is intended. Question number 4. ANSI means blank. A. American National Standards Institute. B. Authority of National Sanitary Institute C. Association of National Sewerage International D. American National Sewerage Institute The answer? It's A. American National Standards Institute American National Standards Institute ANSI stands for American National Standards Institute Question number 5 what do you call an organization that conforms the standards and specifications of all plumbing materials? A Department of Trade and Industry. B. Product Standards of the Philippines. C. Department of Labor and Employment. D. Underwriters Laboratories. The answer is a Department of Trade and Industry. Department of Trade and Industry or DTI. It is an organization that conforms the standards and specifications of all plumbing materials. Department of Trade and Industry Question number 6. What is the recommended hot water supply to a hotel lavatory, private? A. 2 GPH B. 4 GPH C. 6 GPH Or D. 8 GPH The answer? is A, 2 GPH. 2 GPH. The recommended hot water supply to a hotel lavatory, private, is 2 GPH. Question number 7. What does NAMPAP stands for? A National Master Plumbers Association of the Philippines. B, National Master Plumbing Assembly of the Philippines. C, National Master Plumber Assembly of the Philippines. D. National Master Plumbing Association of the Philippines. The answer is a National Master Plumbers Association of the Philippines. National Master Plumbers Association of the Philippines or NAMPAP. It is the national organization's professional body for the Philippine plumbing industry. Question number 8. This principle states that all premises for human habitation, occupancy, or use shall be provided with a supply of pure and wholesome water, neither connected with unsafe water supplies nor subject to hazards of backflow or back siphonage. Letter A, Principle Number 1. B, Principle Number 2. C, Principle Number 3. Or D, 
principle number four? The answer? It's letter A, principle number one. Principle number one. It states that all premises for human habitation, occupancy, or use shall be provided with a supply of pure and wholesome water, neither connected with unsafe water supplies nor subject to hazards of backflow or back siphonage. Question number nine. This principle states that every building having plumbing fixtures installed and intended for human habitation, occupancy, or use on premises abutting on a street, alley or easement where there is a public sewer, shall be connected to the sewer system. Is it letter A? Principle number 3. B. Principle number 4. C. Principle number 5. Or D. Principle number 6. The answer? It's letter C. Principle number 5. Principle number 5 states that every building having plumbing fixtures installed and intended for human habitation, occupancy, or use on premises abutting on a street, alley or easement where there is a public sewer, shall be connected to the sewer system. Principle 5. Connected to sewer system. Question number 10. This principle states that each fixture directly connected to the drainage system shall be equipped with a water seal trap. Letter A, Principle number 10. B, Principle number 11. C, Principle number 12. Or D, Principle number 13. The answer? Is letter A, Principle number 10. Principle number 10 states that each fixture directly connected to the drainage system shall be equipped with a water sealed trap. Remember, Principle 10 shall be equipped with a water sealed trap. Question 11. This principle states that all plumbing fixtures shall be installed properly spaced to be accessible for their intended use. Is it letter A, principle 19, B, principle 20, C, principle 21, or D, principle 22? The answer is principle 20. Principle number 20 states that all plumbing fixtures shall be installed properly spaced to be accessible for their intended use. Again, principle 20. It should be properly spaced. Question 12. This principle states that no water closet shall be located in a room or compartment which is not properly lighted and ventilated. Is it letter A, principle 15? B, principle 16? C, Principle 17 or D, Principle 18. The correct answer is B, Principle number 16. Principle 16 states that no water closet shall be located in a room or compartment which is not properly lighted and ventilated. Question 13. This principle states that plumbing systems shall be subjected to such tests to effectively disclose all leaks and defects in the workmanship. Is it letter A, principle number 15? B, principle number 16? C, principle number 14? Or D, principle number 13? The answer? It's principle number 13. Principle number 13 states that plumbing systems shall be subjected to such tests to effectively disclose all leaks and defects in the workmanship. Note. Principle 13 subject to tests question number 14 what is the rainfall intensity normally used around metro manila area is it a 102 millimeter per hour b 51 millimeter per hour c 76 millimeter per hour or d 127 millimeter per hour the answer it's a 102 millimeter per hour 102 mm per hour. Rainfall intensity normally used around Metro Manila area is 102 mm per hour. Question number 15. What is the PRC resolution number issued by the Board of Master Plumbing for the adoption and promulgation of the revised National Plumbing Code of the Philippines? Is it letter A, resolution number 962? B, resolution number 2? C. Resolution number 1378. Or D. Resolution number 4. The answer? It's letter A. Resolution number 962. Resolution number 962. 
It is the PRC resolution number issued by the Board of Master Plumbing for the adoption and promulgation of the revised National Plumbing Code of the Philippines. Question number 16. What fitting may only be used for vertical to horizontal change of direction of drainage piping when installed in true vertical position? Is it letter A, Y, B, 60 degree bend, C, 90 degree bend, or D, combination Y? The answer is D, combination Y. Combination Y. It is the fitting that may only be used for vertical to horizontal change of direction of drainage piping when installed in true vertical position. Combination Y. Question number 17. Aside from the number of fixture units connected to it, the size of the vent piping is determined by its blank. Is it letter A, length? B, slope? C, change in direction? Or D, orientation? The answer is letter A, length. Aside from the number of fixture units connected to it, the size of the vent piping is determined by its length. Remember that the size of the vent piping is determined by the number of fixture units connected to it or by its length. Question 18. The curb of threshold of a shower compartment may be eliminated when blank. Is it letter A, to comply with accessibility standards? B, for gang showers? C, in hospitals only? Or D, if so desired for safety? The answer? It's letter A, to comply with accessibility standards. The curb of threshold of a shower compartment may be eliminated to comply with accessibility standards. Question 19. Which fixture do not require cleanout on its horizontal drain having a length of less than 1.5 M? Is it letter A, bathtub? B, sink? C, urinal? Or D, drain? The answer? is C. Urinal. Urinal. This fixture do not require cleanout on its horizontal drain having a length of less than 1.5 M. Urinal. Question 20. Void between pipes and sleeves through concrete floor in the ground shall be appropriately sealed with what? Is it letter A, epoxy? B, bitumen? C, oakum? Or D, solder? The answer is letter B, bitumen. Void between pipes and sleeves through concrete floor in the ground shall be appropriately sealed with bitumen. It is a sticky, black, highly viscous liquid or semi-solid form of petroleum. Question 21. Shower water heaters shall be adjusted to deliver hot water with maximum temperature of what? Is it letter A, 32.33 Celsius? B. 26.65 Celsius C. 60.28 Celsius Or D. 48.88 Celsius The answer? It's letter D. 48.88 Celsius Shower water heaters shall be adjusted to deliver hot water with maximum temperature of underscore 48.88 degrees Celsius Question 22 no excavation for seepage pit shall extend within how many meters of the water table? Is it letter A, 2 meters? B, 2.5 meters? C, 3 meters? Or D, 4 meters? The answer? It's C, 3 meters. 3 meters. No excavation for seepage pit shall extend within 3 meters of the water table. Question 23. Cesspool may be permitted for use when first approved by the administrative authority and where it is established that a public sewer system will be available in less than how many years? Is it letter A, 3 years? B, 2 years? C, 1 year? Or D, 4 years? The answer? It's letter B, 2 years. 2 years. Cesspool may be permitted for use when first approved by the administrative authority and where it is established that a public sewer system will be available in less than two years. Question 24. In lieu of upper terminal cleanout for building drain slash sewer, what can be substituted? Is it letter A, a two-way cleanout? B, Y branch cleanout? 
C. House trap. Or D. Backwater valve. The answer? It's letter A. Two way clean out. In lieu of upper terminal clean out for building drain slash sewer, two way clean out can be substituted. Question 25. It is a Siamese connection with 125 mm diameter. Is it letter A, three way? B, one way? C, two way? Or D, four way? The answer? Is letter A, three way? Three way. Siamese connection with 125 mm diameter is a three way. How about a break? We still have some more questions on the next part. Link will be posted on the description box. Make sure you hit like click subscribe and ring that notification bell to be updated. Good, Good luck! luck.